Okay, here's the Aero Star, the Aero Star. So the Aero Star has been sitting for quite a while. And we don't have a battery in it. And right now I was just going to try and turn the key over. And I had two keys made. This originally, what I had to do is if you pull the uh, cylinder out of the if you pull the cylinder out of the passenger side door, the, the lock cylinder, you can have a key made. And what they told me is that the on some models the passenger door key may be similar, but it may not be similar. And so basically they said we're going to make you two keys and we're going to try and see what happens. And so this one here, basically if I put the key in, and actually I sprayed tri-flow in there to try and loosen it up. It's not tight or anything, but the thing is is that it won't it won't turn over. Pull it out just a notch, same thing. It's locked in there. Push it in all the way. It's locked. The steering wheel is not locked. And gear shift gear shift's in part. <clears throat> so basically I've tried both these keys on this thing. And so here's the, the door cylinder key. And this door cylinder key looks very similar, but it's not the same. You can see they're basically uh, some extra cuts on one. And But in any case, none of them work. That one doesn't work. This one here doesn't work. Now on these, on this particular one, in order to pull the cylinder out, you have to set it to the on position. I can't get it to the on position. So if you do get it into the on position, there's a hole right here. You can see that hole. And if you stick like a uh, flathead screwdriver in there and you have this to the on position, this will slide right out. But it's not it's not moving and I've actually tried these keys before I had one of these keys working I'm not sure which one but I had one of them working and it worked fine but the thing is is it's set for five months and now it don't do squat so yeah if you got any ideas let me know and uh, I'd like to get this thing running otherwise what I'm gonna have to do is I'm gonna have to pull this cap off this uh, decorative cap thing and then then just drill it out and remove it and then try and save the, the housing so that I can slide the new one back in otherwise and